the weirdest thing. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, what is that? What does a high school, a restaurant, and an old prison have in common? Many would say nothing. This next compilation begs to differ. In this video, we'll be counting down top 5 most haunted clips, which probably you shouldn't watch alone at night, even though you might anyway. As ever, if you're new here, thanks for joining us. If you're into scary, strange, and paranormal, captured on camera, then you're in the right place. By subscribing, you'll be sure to never miss out on our new videos. For updates about upcoming videos and more, follow our social media on the link below. Now let's jump into this video. Number 5. Teabag Anomaly Could this have been a prank being pulled on an innocent customer going about the usual shopping at the store? Or was there something more to it? Around the year 2014, at the Whitstable Nutrition Centre somewhere in the world, CCTV captured a clip showing a box of tea bags seemingly slipping out of a store shelf and floating mysteriously in mid-air. Could this be the spirit of a deceased former employee trying to help customers out with their shopping? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Yeah, check this out. Like, this guy here, watch behind his head. What? Keep watching. Oh. Just, just look at the shelf. It's the weirdest thing. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, what is that? It's just blowing, I don't know, I don't know. Oh my god. Check this out. This guy here, watch behind his head. Oh my god, oh my god. It's the weirdest thing. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, what is that? It's just blowing, I don't know, I don't know. Oh my god. Oh my god, that looks like a poster or something like that. Subscribe and turn on notifications for future videos. Number 4. The Famished Spirit this next video takes us to Jimmy's World Bar and Grill in their Luton restaurant in the UK. After getting reports from one of their customers that they saw a plate flying off a table, naturally they went back and checked their CCTV footage. Based on what the footage shows, this was most likely the work of a poltergeist. Focus your attention on the table closest to the camera and watch what happens after the lady gets up.
Number 3. Asheville High School Like many other high schools in the United States, Asheville High School houses a video surveillance system. On this one occasion, the CCTV cameras captured some concerning footage at around 2.51am in the morning. A shadowy figure can be seen moving across the frame, perhaps a student who passed on but never quite moved on. Although some of the school staff weren't admitting to this being a clear sign that their school is haunted, they weren't saying it isn't either. Let me know what you make of the literacy teacher's reaction to this situation in the comments. High's video surveillance system is just like that in any other high school. But what was captured by a camera in the rotunda of Asheville High in the wee hours of the morning was anything but ordinary. That's the coolest thing I've ever seen. I mean, because look, it looks like a person. Yeah. When it really does. A child, right? No. Teacher and literacy coach Martha Geithner knows what she sees in the surveillance video, captured at 2.51 a.m. Friday, August 1st. What do you think? Watch to the left of your screen. This is what you first see over here. Some folks have described it as, you know, the shape of a child or something like that. Uh, someone else who looked at it said, it looks like it takes a couple of steps. The motion-activated recorder goes off for 24 seconds, indicating no movement. And then you see the shape again, above the elevator. It travels to the hallway, and here's where things get perplexing for skeptics. But look at the shadow on the floor coming from those lights. Glazner won't say it's a ghost, but he won't say it's not. I'm a logical person, I think, and I wanted to be able to explain to these folks or anybody, this is what I think it is. It's a bat flying around up here and it casts a shadow. But then why is the shadow down here from a different angle and it's not a shape of a bat, so... It's going to be on sourdough, okay? Folks at the Birdhouse Cafe across the street are excited by whatever it is. I'm just not one of those. I don't go looking for things like that, but when I saw that, it made me wonder. It does take on the silhouette of a human, of a body. Everyone agrees at this point, the shape in the shadows so far can't be explained. I think it's a ghost. And Mrs. Geithner has her own theory about why whatever it is, is there. It's a ghost. Of course it's a ghost. It's the ghost of some former student who's really angry with his teacher and has come back to get back at the teacher. And he's just making himself known at this time. Number two, do not disturb. In what looks like an exploration video, the camera person zeroes in in what looks like an old house in the woods somewhere. Although the footage is not clear, being captured in low light during nighttime, they hit payload when they point the camera through one of the property's windows. What they capture next is reminiscent of what you'd see in Hollywood films such as Insidious, Annabelle or The Conjuring. Let me know what you make of this. <laughs> 